it's chatty abby here we are today with snowflakes by tom mcdonald i'm very excited it's been a minute since we've had a political commentary from tom i am not playing it safe i said what i said it is what it is i don't care if you mad at me okay go ahead and change the channel let's jump into this if you lie to the government, they'll put you in prison. But when they lie to all of us, it's called being a politician. Yes. So Roger Stone lied to the government about something that didn't even matter in the whole trial. And they tried to put him away in prison for life. But when the whole entire investigation was built on lies, oh, that's just being a politician. That's just politics. Like, seriously? <laughs> anyway, I love this set. So we've got trash and is that a american flag in the background and trash cans and tom mcdonald is trash <laughs> okay loving this let's oh we've got a we've got a statue of liberty in the background here too interesting you think taking guns away will save our kids from the killings? But your pro-choice abortion kills way more children. If America's so terrible and racist, it probably isn't safe to encourage immigration. Just saying, all the- Yeah. If America's so evil and racist, it's probably not safe to encourage immigration. <laughs> the contradictions are embarrassing. You know who hates America the most? Americans. Trigger warnings used to be on TV for seizures. And now they're everywhere to protect millennials' feelings. He, she, his, him, hers, them, they screw up pronouns. Because everyone's a retard these days. We hear him preaching at the protest that hatred's the problem. But hating straight men, white folks, and Christians is common. Coca-Cola telling people they should be less white. They preach intolerance, but if you disagree, they fight. There's a race war here. Elections based on fear. Black lives okay, only so matter once every four years. Protest vibes. Um not protests peaceful protests riots i'm getting riot vibes from this and look we've got the snow and then we've got cop car that person looked like blair white to me is that who that was or because i didn't look like nova soldiers died for this country and every one of us benefits give welfare to the bums and forget about the veterans yeah. black folks and white folks divided by the news but we are all the same we are red is, white and blue ashamed to be american okay that's cool because honestly we are all ashamed of you too so <laughs> that's a great line that is totally blair white Ah, I can't believe she's in this video. <laughs> oh my gosh. Do y'all know who Blair White is? Because that like puts a whole new level on this video and everything he's saying. Oh my goodness, that is genius. I love that. I'm a really big Blair White fan. So I get that. Um, if you don't know, Blair White is um, transgender and she's not crazy like the rest of the world, in my opinion. So she's got a really, really great perspective on things. Anyway, she's totally in this video. Set us up to fail, that's what they built the system for. Put an ammunition shop across the street from a liquor store. Empowering women used to be different than this before. The role models got OnlyFans or dance on a stripper pole. Oh my gosh, and that's so true. We're like, oh, feminism, feminism. And then it's like, oh, here's your role models, women. OnlyFans stars and strippers and stripper poles. You know, like when we're talking about empowering women, women have always been strippers and that's always been a role and a position that women have been allowed to have that's not exactly empowering for anybody. That's something that has been around forever and I don't think we should be glorifying that. I mean, if we, you know, talking about empowering women, it should be to be whatever they wanna be and have any profession or job or position in, you know, that they would like. And if they would like to be mothers and wives that should be totally fine too because that's what i am and i think it's fine <laughs> screw it i ain't tripping i don't mean to be mean but if our children are the future then our future is bleak they take an adderall to focus hit mcdonald's to eat they're addicted to phones and they take xanax to sleep they blurred the lines dividing communism and democracy in 2021 we paint the patriots as nazis the men playing women's sports get trophies for winning like great let's celebrate a man for beating some women if you're 
Yeah, let's celebrate a man for beating some women. Oh, Blue Ray talks about that too. You should look that up. Um, so yeah, Joe Rogan talks a lot about that too, especially like in fighting sports. A person who's been a man his whole life and then just transitioned is now fighting against biologically female women. And then getting trophies for literally beating women. <laughs> Ugh. Progress. Black, your life matters, you're supposed to embrace it. If you're rich or you're smart, then you're probably Asian. If you're gay, then you're brave. All of that I'm okay with. But if you're white, the stereotype is you are a racist. Blaming capitalism like that's the reason things are tough. While you tweet from an iPhone and sip on a Starbucks. You're I know, that part makes me so upset because capitalism has pulled more people out of poverty than any other system ever. And then everybody's super mad at capitalism for there being poor people, as if capitalism created poor people. People have been poor from the very beginning. That's our natural way of being. Capitalism has made some people rich and has made more people, pulled pe more people out of poverty than anything else any other system we've tried. Supporting what you stand against, you don't think you are, but a Percocet addict don't donate money to pharma. Damn dog, we're all afraid to speak the truth. And the more afraid we get, the more we hate the ones who do. You're ashamed to be American? Okay, that's cool. Cause honestly, we are all ashamed of you too. Y'all are so fake, oh no. The forecast said that there'd be snowflakes, whoa. You can make us see it your way, no way. I like that, that you can't make us see it your way. No way. Yeah, that's so true. I think having conversations is really important and talking about different perspectives, but you can't force somebody to see it your way. That's just, it doesn't, it's not how that works. We can all get along, but there's no stopping. Everybody's wrong, that's a real problem. They don't want to hear it, but they still talk it. Soon enough, we're running out of options. This ain't gonna end till it's in the coffin. We ain't gonna be friends till we try to squash it. I don't know how we can make amends or we drop it. Snowflakes melt when it's hot, kid. Y'all are so fake. Oh no. The forecast said that there'd be snowflakes. Whoa. You can make oh. us see it your way, no way. Gasoline and propane, more flames. Oh no, no more snowflakes. I absolutely, absolutely, absolutely love that Blair White was in that video. That makes me so happy and excited. I don't know why, but it like really, really, really does. That makes me so, so happy. Um, yeah. There's two genders. I'm not mad at the rest. I'm just confused when a dude has a boob, um, has some, a beard and breasts, something like that. You see, he doesn't really have a problem when he's got Blair White coast, like starring in his video. Ugh, right? Ah, okay. Do you guys love this too? Is this just me? I love it. He talks about immigration and abortion and, you know, homelessness and the veterans and <laughs> there's no shortage of issues in this video. Anyway, love you all. Bye.